I just hope Diana goes home. You don't like Diana? I can't deal with her. I deal with I her every either. day. If you guys did, I think you'd eat a gun. Are you sure it's going to be Diana? We have the answer. It's. Oh! Yeah! Hey guys. Whoa! Whoa! Hi. Oh my! Wait, wait! Oh, Debbie! Whoa! What the f Teresa walks in, and freaking Diana comes in after her, and I'm like, God has it in for me. I must have murdered someone in a previous life because I am stuck with these two numb nuts bitches once again, who couldn't have an idea if it hit him in the face. You want to hear this story? Yeah. yeah. Kind of. Debbie brought less than me. Of the three of So it wasn't fair to have. So if Aubrey had been back in there, Aubrey would have Aubrey was at the table mentioned several times. So not a smart decision from our project manager. Oh, well, that's what you think. You won your task because we were all team players. Give me some popcorn. Okay. Yeah, that's the thank reason, you so much that's for the my reason team why you, to work you won so your hard. Task, and I'm we... proud of it. And I'm so happy that everybody so, worked so hard for that. And I didn't say you didn't work hard. So just don't. Thank you. We all worked very hard And I today. said that. That's it. That's it. I feel sorry for us tomorrow, just trying to figure out who could project manage and all that. We'll just have to see. <laughs> I am very happy with my new team. So if Lisa's frustrated for still being on the team with me, too bad for her. So of course, Mr. Trump leaves me and Diana together and throws in Lou, who I knew was gonna bring nothing to the table. I'm literally in what's my version of hell, and I'm gonna to have to deal with these idiots the rest of my eternity. Thank you, God. A 25-year-old girl, her level of maturity, I can tell she's artistic, she's got an eye, she's got an intelligence. When Dee started with his Diana's so smart and I was like, could I get the puke bucket now? Because what's she said? I'm so sick of dealing with people who are not contributing anything. And then you have teammates going, did you hear that fabulous idea? It's like, no, nobody else did either, delusional. I feel very more fatherly uh, than anything else towards Diana. I'm be unpopular with both of you, but I honestly think having Diana in a bikini is a big mistake. Okay. It should be a really classy, one-piece, elegant. Lisa, I don't have a one-piece bathing suit. All I wear are thongs. Why did you keep saying, oh, your team said you had no ideas. You're doing great. I just give a listen. Sometimes people come up with it ideas. It doesn't matter. Do you yeah. like carrying people? I had no problem working with Diana. I did not think she was vacuous or dumb. I find her to be very bright and mature. I have trouble, I not have trouble telling the truth, just I don't see it, you know? She wasn't- you didn't see she's stupid. I think the perspective Lisa has on Diana is terribly unfair. In recent years, I tried to pull back and be less vicious. D is so far up Diana's it's like, as if he's sitting there watching her as a two-year-old getting potty trained and has to pretend every dump is beautiful. Guess what? We just end up flushing it, like all of her ideas. And I'm just in hell, because no one will freaking talk about it. Hi! How, How are, are you? How are you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm Diana Mendoza. How are you? <laughs> I'm Miss Universe 2008! Thank you, thank you. As you'll notice in beauty pageants, pageant girls like me are always walking. That is great. Can I, can I try? Sure, give it, give it a pajama. Thank you, thank you. Give it a little walk and go to the uh, Walgreens website. And Walgreens. Should I pass in my sick. crown? <laughs> <laughs> but Diana Mendoza came to the rescue incredibly. So bravo, Diana. The best of us couldn't have done better. We need someone to demonstrate dating and flirting while walking. How about, how about you, sir? Right over here. We'll demonstrate dating and flirting. Step aside, beauty queen. Some guys like a little cushion, OK? <laughs> Lisa, who would you fire? Um, I wouldn't be a boardroom if I didn't say I'd bring in Diana. No, I know. I stay <laughs> Like, let's go. Diana, why do people keep bringing you back? I don't know. I'm now sorry. we're talking about men bringing you back. Before the women, I understand that maybe they don't like the way you look, meaning you look too good. Who knows? I am sick of this pressure from women who all they do is look in a mirror. You develop a talent and a brain, and then maybe the world will take you seriously.